The command window in AutoCAD offers efficient keystroke access to commands and system variables. You can even use it to find other content such as blocks, hatch patterns, and layers. You can dock the command window at the top or bottom of the drawing area, or you can have it float anywhere on your screen, including a second monitor. Control the width of the command window, as well as how many lines of command history it displays. You can apply and adjust transparency, allowing you to see geometry beneath it. In addition to launching AutoCAD commands by entering the full command name, you can use command aliases, which are shortened command names. For example, instead of entering line or offset to launch those commands, you can simply enter L or O to save keystrokes. AutoCAD includes command aliases for many commands, and you can easily create or modify them to meet your needs. As you begin typing in the command window, AutoCAD automatically completes the entry with a valid AutoCAD command or alias. If you pause, it displays a suggestion list of commands, aliases, system variables, and other content that matches your entry. If the command or other item is at the top of the list, you can press Enter to launch it, or continue entering more characters to narrow the list. You can scroll down the list at any time to select the item you want. Autocomplete even supports midstring search, enabling you to enter a string of characters from anywhere in the command or other item, so you don't have to remember the exact name. For example, if you type setting on the command line, the suggestion list displays commands containing the word setting anywhere within them, not just at the beginning. The command window also supports autocorrect, minimizing the need for you to re-enter a command if you accidentally mistype it. For example, if you mistakenly type table, T-A-B-E-L, AutoCAD autocorrects to the most relevant and valid AutoCAD command, table, T-A-B-L-E. Just in case that wasn't what you intended, AutoCAD displays a suggestion list of other potential commands and content. You can choose from the list or simply hit enter, accepting the most relevant suggestion without even knowing you mistyped it. If the automatic corrections that AutoCAD suggests are not sufficient to address your common mistakes, you can easily customize the autocorrect list to meet your needs. In addition to offering suggestions for misspelled commands, the AutoCAD command window can suggest relevant AutoCAD commands in place of common synonyms. For example, if you enter symbol in the command window, AutoCAD finds the insert command, so you can insert a block, which is the equivalent of inserting symbols in a drawing. Or, if you enter round, AutoCAD finds the fillet command. If the default synonyms that AutoCAD suggests don't meet your needs, you can easily customize the synonyms list. Commands in the suggestion list are initially displayed in the order of their usage based on general customer data. As you continue to use AutoCAD, the order of commands in the suggestion list will adapt to your own usage habits. After launching a command from the command window, the name of the command is displayed alongside the current prompts or options. Options are displayed with blue text indicating that you can either click on the option in the command window or type the blue characters to access it. In addition to using the command window to access commands and system variables, you can also use it to access drawing content, including layers, blocks, hatch patterns and gradients, textiles, dimension styles, and visual styles. For example, if you enter door at the command line and the current drawing has a block definition with the name door, you can quickly insert it right from the suggestion list.